Hello, friends, neighbors, and pals. It's Tony. Tony, I am back here at the Rhinestone Room, back here at the Vegas Voice uh, Studios in Henderson, and I'm very, very excited to introduce our next guest here in the Rhinestone Room. It's a, it's a very nice lady and a very sweet lady who's who's got my name, or I've got her name, uh, but it's it's Tony with an I, and I'm Tony with a Y. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Tony Jackson from the Firelight Barn here in Henderson. And so it's wonderful to have you. Thank you. It's an honor to be here. Thank oh, you. gosh. I don't know about honor. Yeah. I'm telling you, because your name <laughs> precedes you, your reputation and everything, yeah. and all of a sudden, I get to have you in my theater, and yes. I'm here in your... Show. Yes, thank you so much. I'm so looking forward to it. Um, I'm going to be, I'm going to be um, at your dinner dinner theater on November fourth. I correct. believe it is. Is that it's correct? A Saturday. It's a Saturday. Yes. And I went to your uh, dinner theater for dinner and for a show, and it was it was the family. Right. The family was doing the whole um, show. There wasn't it wasn't a, a celebrity guest or anything like that. Right. But it was the family, and I was so. I was so taken with the whole dinner theater experience mm -hmm. because it's not just a dinner theater and performance. It was the whole family involved right. with uh, producing the show, starring in the show, serving dinner, serving. Um, uh, I loved dessert because it was it was, <laughs> it was somebody walking around with two. Uh, popsicle boxes, <laughs> right? And I had my choice of like a creamsicle and a, and a regular fudge bar. A fudge bar, that's what I it know. was. It's amazing yes. how how excited people get over that. I <laughs> was, I was. I had, had somebody had a, a box under each arm, going, "Would you like a fudge bar? Would you, would you like, <laughs> you know, a creamsicle?" And I thought, God, how cool is that? Nobody ever comes table side, right. you know, to to bring you a fudge So <laughs> that, 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 that was funny, uh, but it's all a Kind of a, a country western theme, right. isn't it? Um, right, but all the shows are not country, and right. also even with the country theme shows, there's a lot of variety in those. Uh, people that come to me after the show say, "I don't even like country music, and I loved the show." Yeah, yeah. So it, there's a little something for everyone. Yeah, absolutely. All the time. It was, um, and what was great is uh, there was no, there was no. Uh, Ego involved. There was no pretentiousness um, with the family. These, these obviously, your your kids and yourself are very talented and have obviously been at this for quite some time. Right. And and you could see that. You could see that these weren't just just a little family going here. We're here to perform. I mean, it was it was very well thought out and 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 produced beautifully. Thank you. And uh, it was just it was a lot of fun. I don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> when I came, and I have to be honest with you, I don't, I don't know exactly what I was expecting, but it was, it was fun, and it was, um, it, it was, it was down home, mm -hmm. but it wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't cheesy down home. You know what I mean? There, we there try was... to make everyone feel like part of the family when they come. Yeah. And I think that's the feeling that you got. And just like yes. running into Johnny Bird here. And right. um, he says, I want to be part of your family. And I'm like, I'll adopt you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is great. That's just awesome. Well, and Johnny, Johnny gets, like your family, he gets along with everybody. And everybody gets along with him. And he's, mm -hmm. he's, um, just easy going, mm -hmm. and I, that's what I found about um, the Firelight Barn. It was just very, very easily going. Tell me how, or tell us how the your family came, became um, this performing family. So it started when uh, I was teaching music lessons, mm. and as my babies came along one at a time, um, I would be teaching piano lessons, and they would be playing at my feet. Uh, so I think they just absorbed all this music. So yeah. it's been 22 years as a family wow. band that we've been performing. And we used to be touring, performing all over the United really? States, performing in Canada, Europe, and had some really great experiences. But as we were performing all over, uh, we would experience dinner theaters yeah. all across yeah. the country and take notes, mental notes, what we liked and what we didn't like, what we could mm -hmm. utilize, what mm -hmm. we didn't want to. And so when the kids became of the age that they're dating and getting married and don't want to go out on the road so much anymore, yeah. um, then we decided it's time to open the dinner mm -hmm. theater. And so we opened. We were in a little small 900 square foot uh, wow. uh, lease, you know, little spot in a strip right. mall. And um, and so you know you look at from where we were at and now the nice building that we're in um, that we're 
buying, so it's not like we have to move around anymore right, and lease a different right. spot where they're permanently. And and it's a great location. It was great because the parking's great. It's free. Yes. Yeah. And um, it's uh, our own building, standalone. It's not in a strip mall. It's right. easy to find. It's just a really great energy in the area, right across from the Water Street District, where the hockey rinks and yes. all that action is going yeah. on. So it's a really, really great location. Oh, that's fantastic. So this is your first time owning um, your, your own mm -hmm. space. Yep. That's fantastic. Yeah. That's yeah. great. Well, your kids, I have to tell you, again, when we went to, to see the show, um, we um, we didn't know what to expect, but and I didn't know who was related to who either. <laughs> you know, I didn't know um, if, if there was management here or this was the, the the kids in the show. I didn't know what. But again, my experience was just it was great from the moment we walked in, and everybody was so nice. That was that was you know next time <laughs> you don't see that and feel that everywhere you go. Um, customer service or. You know, just um, just very friendly staff, and so um, I really, really enjoyed it, and I look forward to coming on November fourth. Fourth. Tell tell <laughs> us about your show. What what are people going to expect? Oh gosh, what I, I have people no people already have expectations <laughs> of what he's going to bring. I have no stage. idea <laughs> what they're going to expect yet. Um, actually, I have the I have the the uh, song list uh, down, and but this is my first time doing a country themed. Show. I've never done a country themed show before. I've done a lot of um, oh, Vegas type themed shows and right. so forth. But this, this uh, one of my musical directors, Michael Dubé, he'll be playing uh, for my show. I said this is a great opportunity now, Tony, to to do a country themed show. And I went, hmm, all right, well let's try it. And I think it would. I think it's going to. Um, um, I think it's going to blend well with the atmosphere, right. and it's something I've never done before. So I thought this is going to be great. So I'm, I'm really looking forward to it. And uh, it's been a pleasure to talk to your fans, as uh, they call to make reservations. <laughs> you know, you know who you are, <laughs> and I'm anxious uh, to meet all of you. Yeah. And um, I, it's going to be a Thank great time. You. The Thank energy you. you can tell the energy already yeah. is just. It's just unbeatable. Well, so. thank you. I appreciate that. I really do. And it's and it is gonna, it is going to be a lot of fun. And and um, there's people that are coming to the show that have never, who have never come, who've never seen me um, in this light before. I mean, it's it's always me. I'm always I'm always as a performer and entertainer. It's always me. But in that. Um, um, and that theme has never I've never done before, so I'm, I'm looking forward to, looking forward to it. And also, I grew up with country music. Okay. Uh, my grandparents uh, were from the South, mm -hmm. and uh, so I grew up with this music. So that's why I call it um, classic country uh, okay, concert perfect. because yeah. it's I don't do um, probably any songs that have been out from the last 20 years or something. I, everything is Conway Twitty for me or George Jones or um, Jim Reeves or you know Roger Miller. I mean, yeah, that's that's the country I, I grew, grew up, up with. with. Mm -hmm. So I, I'm, I'm looking forward to this and, and being I able to share. I know the biggest question that I get asked is, is it family friendly? Yes. <laughs> and I, yes. I have been telling everyone, he promises to be good. Yep. It's going to be all family friendly, so don't always, worry. Always, always family friendly. It's it's when the audience um, steps in, steps in, and they 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 after a while don't become family friendly, and I have to <laughs> bring it back. It. I do. I'm like easy, kids, easy, you know. And uh, but again, it, we, just as we talked about before, going on uh, the air that. Um, they, uh, people feel, I paid for a ticket, I'm gonna get what I want. And I go, oh, okay. Right. So I go, you know, my mother's in the audience. They go, I don't care. And I'm like, ah. So yes, I have to be very careful about being family friendly. But thank you, thank you so much for giving me this opportunity yes. to uh, to do the show and to come into your your wonderful family, uh, family friendly uh, atmosphere. And, uh, and I look forward to seeing more of your shows. Thank and you. And thank you for coming um, here you to uh, The Vegas Voice. And we want to thank the people from The Vegas Voice. And we want to thank Tony uh, for being here. And um, um, we will see you very, very soon. Sounds good. Yeah, yeah. Thank, yeah. You. We'll thank you very much. For more for the Firelight Barn, please go to firelightbarn.com. 
and you can find out all the information there. You can also go to TonyArias.com for tickets and show times and things like that. And again, thank you so much to our friends here at The Vegas Voice. We will see you soon here at Tony's Rhinestone Room. Take care. Bye-bye.